What a great week, guys! What a great week! Hello again and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Polish Pete and I'm an eBay reseller based in UK. I buy cheap ladies clothing in bulk and I sell them individually for profit on eBay. Uh, I've got another what sold video for you today, but before we start, if you are interested in this kind of content, please consider subscribing to the channel. It will be greatly appreciated. Okay, guys, uh, first of all, I'm using my replacement phone because uh, my main phone is broke is broken so yeah a boomer but hey uh, guys very good week we had very very good week uh, and I've got one thing to say about it guys I haven't listed anything in this shop anything during last week everything that I have listed was in my second shop same this week I'm not listing anything in this week and we will see how that will reflect on sales but that last week already sums up all those ebay gurus repeating like parrots you have to list on regular basis ideally every day you don't have to you can list 200 items in one day and you will still have decent sales for two three weeks uh, since listing the last item uh, so guys, I've sold so much that I've decided to split last week's sales into two videos. Today I will show you 25 and show you how it looked like in terms of value and stuff like that. And tomorrow I will give you next 25 items and I will show you how much have I earned, what was the profit and all that stuff. Anyway, let's have a look what exactly has sold last week. And the cutoff point was, I believe, 650 uh, plus postage. So anything cheaper than that didn't make it to the video. But like always, you have to be aware that half of my sales was below that 650 plus postage. So guys, last week, meaning from, meaning from Monday uh, the 10th to Sunday the 16th of October, we have sold Whoopi 97 items for a total of £1,039.21. Wow! So we had 27 orders in the bracket 5 to £10, including postage. 53 orders in the bracket 10 to £15. 4 orders in the bracket 15 to £20 and five orders over 20 pounds. However, most of them were those multi-item orders as we had five of them totaling for 14 items. So in five orders, we had 14 items, which was, I believe, five, three, and then two, two, and two. Yeah, I think so. So we've sold 19 items via promoted listings, which has costed us six pounds and 78 pence so only 19 items out of 97 via promoted listings which is something interesting as well in terms of weekly goals we didn't hit that average sale of 11 pounds but we were only 20 29p short however if we consider uh, money per order we were over 11 pounds almost 12 actually we only listed 60 items because I had something else to do, uh, guys, so I couldn't concentrate on listing that much. And all of them were on the second shop. We sold 97 items instead of 56, and we took £1,039 £1, instead of 577 So first item that has sold was this MNS uh, top, like a two-piece look look top. Uh, we took £8.50 as an offer to a watcher. 
plus posteriors. This uh, Lipsy long pullover jumper, uh, it was size 16, so decent size. However, Lipsy is not the best brand on earth. Seven pounds 50, quick sale, I'm happy about that. Uh, this Planet Workwear, uh, like an overcoat, this has sold for 12 pounds and 74 pence in the 15% markdown sale. Uh, we had it from last year, I believe. And we already have a positive feedback, a very enthusiastic one. These, these Royal Robins outdoor trousers, uh, they have sold for nine quid and that was best offer as well. Uh, I think customer came with eight, I counted with nine. And they were 11.99, I believe originally. This Dorothy Perkins pullover jumper, funny story. Lady was pestering me with low ball offers like four quid, four fifty, and four seventy five. I think so. I have written to them to her. Look, I'm not going to sell it that cheap. Please don't try to do it again, uh, because I know for for a fact that this item will sell for more. And funny thing, the same day this item has sold for full asking price nine ninety nine. This Boho faux leather uh, midi skirt, it was size 14. It sold for £8.50 as an offer to a watcher and we've got very enthusiastic uh, positive feedback for it already. This uh, cardigan, uh, like a non-brand, I believe. I think it, yeah, wool collection. Something. I think there was no brand whatsoever on, on it, just a wool sign and stuff like that. Anyway, it was merino wool, but due to the fact it wasn't like a branded one, I've put it on $14.99, then I marked it down to $12.74, and at the end of the day, I have sold it for $10.99 as an offer to a watcher, which is fine. These workwear trousers by Next, they were 14 petite, and they have sold for full asking price 9.99. Uh, this Luisa Ricci uh, pullover jumper, there was no sizing, but I estimated 16 to 18. Uh, yeah, made in Italy, quite nice, but without branding. And well, Luisa Ricci was the brand. I never heard about this brand before. Anyway, uh, 8.50 as an offer to a watcher, very quick sale, so yeah, I'm happy. Uh, this Peruna midi skirt, it was size 14, 100% cotton, more like summer skirt to me. Uh, £8.50 as an offer to a watcher, plus postage. 12 quid altogether, just over. Uh, this straight denim jeans, they were unbranded, uh, but they, were, they had nice khaki, kind of greenish, brownish color. I knew somebody will like them, so I put them on $7.99, although they were unbranded, and they have sold super quickly for that $7.99. And I have already positive feedback for them as well. This Imagine pullover jumper, uh, I had it for $12.99, then marked it down by 15%, and it has sold for $11.04. Uh, and again, super quickly, as soon as I put it down, it has sold within... I don't know, maybe three, four days. This MS workwear cardigan, uh, this was size 10 petite. Petite doesn't sell for me. However, lately I'm selling more and more of those petite items. $9.99 full asking price plus postage. Uh, these boot cut uh, denim jeans by Next, they were size 16. Uh, they have sold for $8.49 which was 15% off of $9.99. This Evans midi skirt, it was size 24, so super size, I love sizes like that. £8.50 as an offer to a watcher, and plus postage on top. These workwear trousers, they were only size 12, however, Marks & Spencer sells, no matter what size it is. Uh, yeah, $8.49 as a part of Markdown sale. 
this uh, MNS MIDI skirt, it was size 16. I had it for a while, at least for a, for a year, because I've gone down with the price. Maybe at least at least six months, I would say like that. I can't, I can't remember how long do I have it, but at least 16 months because, sorry, six months, because I go down by a pound on the price after six months, and I, I am completely sure that I've started with 9.99. Anyway, 750 as an offer to a watcher plus postage on top. This Viela, 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 I, I believe Viela, uh, Viela pullover jumper without sizing, worked out as 12 to 14, brown in color, merino wool. I've listed for 14.99, sold super quickly within a week or two uh, for full asking price 14.99. This Eastex blouse, uh, it was size 20, so good size, £8.99, full asking price, quite happy to see it gone. Uh, this was part of multi-item order, I believe. I ordered three items all together, uh, black, all black tops, uh, 7 50 for that, and 7 50 for this one as well. It was like more like fine knit pullover jumper. Uh, she said she needs them for work and she, she she has a new work. They want her to wear black and she doesn't have an, any single black item. So she bought three items. This pullover, the top that I just shown and some cheap metal on top for like 350 or something like that. This Nightingale's, uh, Nightingale's uh, midi skirt was size 4, 24, super size, sells super quickly. Uh, very positive feedback for this uh, for this skirt already. Eight pound fifty as an offer to a watcher, and that was uh, as well multi item order. Lady bought two MNS jeans, two pairs of MN MNS jeans. So these size twenty MNS jeans for eight fifty as an offer to a watcher, and these Peruna jeans as well. Again, size 50, obviously, because they were going to the same lady. Again, 850 as an offer to a watcher. I think I'm selling them too cheap, to be fair. Uh, I may start to put those MNS jeans for 11.99 and see if that will uh, make any difference, basically. At least those sizes above 18, I would say. And we've got the last item for today. Don't, don't forget to watch me tomorrow as well for the other part, and these Cherokee Cordroys have sold for $8.99 super quickly. I should put them for $9.99 really, or maybe even more, they, but they were only Cherokee, which is Tesco brand. So I was like, Tesco, hmm. And I was like thinking $8.99 will be actually uh, kind of uh, uh, high. However, they have sold within days for that $8.99, maybe within a week of listing or something like that. I think they were part of my listings going up during the weekend and they have sold, you know, during the week after that weekend, if that makes sense. Yeah. Anyway, $8.99 plus postage is great for Chiroki item. So yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Well, I'm going to do the wrapping. I'm going to do the closing and then I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, so guys, last week on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday, we have sold more than in the previous week. Uh, but before we, uh, but after that, we had a hiccup on Friday and uh, then well over 200 pounds on saturday and half decent sunday however that sunday was lower than the sunday before so we will see what are we going to sell and how much are we going to sell this week i expect a drop in sales because like i've said i'm not going to list anything and this is like when you pass the 15th of the month the 15th day of the month sales historically always were a bit lower 
because I think people, you know, start running out of money. Uh, yeah, that's it for today, guys. I hope you found this video interesting. If you have, please don't forget to click that like button because I want you to help me to reach some new viewers. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so. And I'll see you tomorrow with the second part of this video. Have a great time. God bless you all. God bless people of Ukraine. Bye-bye.